Good evening, brethren. Since we can't actually physically get together, I thought I would come down to the lodge and record some of the historical items that we have, I've talked about many times, I've done some research, and thought I would share it with you for posterity's sake. One of which is this, the Midnight Ride of Paul Revere. It's a painting that if you look on the, in the inscription, it's, it was donated, it was given to Corinthian Lodge in 1902 by Nathaniel Revere, the great-grandson of Paul Revere. And it also says it was painted in 1858, which back in the fall, I thought that's kind of interesting because Revere, I'm told, was, was really a kind of a, an obscure character. Nobody really knew very much of him, maybe unless you're from New England. But um, no one really knew of him until Longfellow published The Midnight Ride of Paul Revere in 1861. So. Hmm. Could this be a very highly valuable um, early inspiration for some of the other paintings? It could because I look at this and, you know, I swear I've seen this before. This looks so familiar. I've seen, I think, postcards and, and other different things that uh, look just like this. So I reached out to the Paul Revere house and talked to uh, or, or, or exchanged some emails with Edith Steblecki and she, uh, she, she did some research for me, and if you do some searches for this image on the internet, you'll find some way better ones. In fact, in 1867, Charles G. Bush uh, was a wood carver, uh, did, a, did a wood carved print of, of this with way more detail um, for Harper's Weekly. And uh, that one's patented or trademarked or art. He has his name on it. If you look at this, there's no signature, not a lot of detail. Um, it's nice, we're very happy to have it. We've had it in the lodge now for going on 120 years. Uh, it was given to us by a descendant of Paul Revere, which makes it extremely special, but it's not 1858 um, and not a great original work. So it's a copy that came down, came down later, a copy of the Bush work. But, uh, there you have it, a little bit of history about the painting that's up in the, uh, in the library.